Hey, this is John Carlos, and I'm here with a look at the Harry Potter Funko Pop of Albus Dumbledore. I gotta say, just looking at this pop hanging out here, it's a good looking pop. Maybe that's because many of the figures in the series are wearing like dark outfits, black robes and, and you know, like dark gray cloaks for like Voldemort and stuff. Uh, and this one's more colorful and it stands out. Or it's just the fact that it's a good looking little wizard pop. But either way, I really dig how this turned out. Because there's a lot of good little details within this. Um, first of all, it's good sculpt on his beard. Uh, I think like the little sculpted lines within it are really, really impressive. Also, his eyeball paint's good. I like his kind of gray, bushy eyebrows. And this one's got really clean uh, glasses. I saw some when I was hunting for this where the gold paint bled onto the lenses or the frames were a little bent because it is kind of like a soft material. Um, also, if you're hunting for this in person and you care about this sort of thing, be on the lookout for a separation between the hat and the head. The hat is a separate piece that's attached, and I saw some where the gap was very noticeable. Uh, but the hat is really well done. The, uh, the texturing here, this little broken up pattern and all the different designs within each section, very impressive to me. I like the way that this was put together. Also, I like the gold stars. There's just, it's, uh, it's not a simple pop. There's some really, really good designs going on in here. Same thing with his body. Uh, if you turn to the side, you can see more of it. You can see that pattern that's been uh, sculpted and the detail within it, very, very strong. I like the little lining going around the bottom and the overall swirly pattern going around the base of it. Also, this is the only uh, pop in this series that isn't holding a wand or an umbrella. It's the only one that doesn't have an accessory in its hand. And I like that it, it, he's in this kind of calm pose. It's very appropriate for Dumbledore. Um, also, the little edges of the uh, cloak, the edges of his robe sleeve. I like the way they implied a little fluffy pattern there and that little tiny uh, squared pattern with a little dot in the middle. Great detail in this. Tiny details, little buttons going all the way up the middle. Really strong work. Overall, it's a very simple pop, but there's some really kind of good detail within it. It has a nice presence on the shelf. He looks cool. He looks cute. If you like Dumbledore, you like Harry Potter, I don't see why you're not going to like this, because I certainly do. Thanks for watching.